envelope. I am very excited to open today Saloon Box. Look how amazing this box is. Saloon Box is uniquely crafted cocktails sent straight to your door. And if anybody knows anything about my husband, that is right up his alley. Each cocktail is curated by a bartender or mixologist based on their experience. Um, the boxes start at $37.50 each. I don't know if there's a prepaid discount or not. But what I really love about this is the owners of Saloon Box are just like my husband and I. They're a husband and wife team that have other jobs that came together to fulfill a need. And might I add, her name is also Samantha. People just can't help how amazing things just fall together. So, let's dive in. I haven't peeked inside, so I don't know what, what to think. I do know that their website is amazing, great website. So, as expected, the presentation is unbelievable. Great box, as this guy say. Okay, it breaks down the ingredients. I don't want to read too much because I'll ruin it. Looks like our drink is Rye Got Laid. That's so cute. The quality of this card is unbelievable. You could keep this in your bar area and it would withstand time. Okay. Let's dive in. I wish I had like higher than a 10 on presentation because this would easily exceed that. Super exciting. We have a Firestone Easy Jack IPA. That's great. Okay. We have hundred percent pineapple juice. Rye Whiskey, Crater Lake. Two of those guys. Okay, I'm gonna get everything out. My little short self has to turn this around and see. Don't give me the opportunity to see the other side of the box. Okay. No! Lemon, fresh lemon, and oh, all natural brown sugar. Wow, there's a lot in here. Okay, I think I got it all. So naturally, what's next? Let's make a cocktail. Okay guys, are you ready to mix? Disclaimer, I never cook or mix drinks. I mean, I guess I occasionally cook if you count Blue Apron, Plated, etc. Those, I'm pretty amazing at. Mixing drinks never happens. So y'all are gonna get to probably see me mix my first drink ever without my husband um, actually doing it. So. Here we go. It says, directions, reserve two orange pills for garnish. We'll see. In a shaker with no ice, add the rye. This will prove how easy or not easy it is if I can do it. Lemon juice. I think my husband said you're supposed to roll it to get the juice to the center. Let's put it this way.
Okay, next it says to add two ounces of pineapple juice. This is a five ounce can, so a lot of portions. Can you see it on the cook? Okay, two teaspoons of brown sugar. I bake, so I can do a little better with this. Do a dry shake for 20 seconds. This might be my first time to ever do this. This is kind of exciting. I don't know if my husband knows I'm mixing these, so I'm gonna make it and take it out to him and see what he says. Hopefully it's good. And I'm not a beer drinker, so this should be interesting. He's a huge IPA guy, loves them, so um, I'll be interested to see what he thinks. Nothing's chilled here, but we brought ice, so it may be fine. Woo! Okay, my party is starting without me being ready. That was really good. Okay. Add fresh ice and shake for another 20 seconds. Oh, good. Mm, how much ice do you add to these things? I like cold, cold drinks. Let's get the main. Here we go. Ooh, it's getting cold. Next, it says to strain into a Collins glass filled with one ice cube. I don't really know what a Collins glass is, but. And my husband all, has all these super fancy ice creams he uses for everything. I don't know what those are either. Okay. That looks good. It smells so good. Okay, then it says to top off with three ounces of IPA. Okay, even despite my crazy orange mix-up, this thing is very, very good. And obviously really easy to make. Everything I need is here. I still have pineapple juice left over, I still have IPA left over, and obviously fresh fruit. So I have some rye whiskey laying around, which coincidentally I do. We can go for another round. Saloon Box, thank you so much for sending this over. Thumbs up. I mean, super, super impressive. Cheers to you guys. We're proud of y'all. Have a good night. Bye, y'all.